Hello and welcome to this channel. In this video, we are going to look at how to find the missing element of a matrix, in this case X, and also how to find the inverse of this same matrix K. Alright, so how are we going to find this missing element of this matrix K? So to find the value of X, we are going to use the formula for finding the determinant of a matrix. Okay, let's say, for example, we have this matrix here. Let's say this matrix is matrix A. So for you to find the determinant of the matrix A, you are going to say 2 times 5, so 2 times 5, okay, so this is called the major diagonal, so you, you multiply the major diagonal, the numbers that are in the major diagonal, then minus 3 times 4, so you also multiply the numbers that are in the minor diagonal, okay, so this is going to be 2 times 5 is 10, minus 3 times 4 is 12, 10 minus 12 is negative 2. So this is the determinant. All right. So we are going to use this same method to find uh, the missing element X of this matrix. Okay. So we are going to say, so this is the, the first part. We are going to say the determinant of the matrix K is equal to 8 times x. Remember, this is a major diagonal. So 8 times x minus 9x times 1. So 9x times 1. All right. So now, here where there is determinant of k, the determinant of the matrix K we've been given as 2. So meaning here, where there's determinant of K, we are going to substitute a 2. Then we're going to have is equal to 8 times X is 8X minus 9X times 1 is 9X. All right. So we're going to have 2 is equal to 8x minus 9x is negative x. Okay, so to find the value of x, you divide both sides by negative 1. So this is going to be positive x, then 2 divided by negative 1 is negative 2. Alright, so therefore, x is equal to negative 2. So this is the value of x. All right. So this means that the matrix K will now be, will now look like this. Will now look like this. We have 8 9 x we found that x is negative 2. So we are going to replace a negative 2 here. Okay? Then down here we are going to put a negative 2. Since x is negative 2, then 1. So we simplify. k is equal to 8. 9 times negative 2 is negative 18. Then here we are going to have 1, then negative 2. So this is what the matrix k looks like after finding the missing element. All right, so, but our interest was just to find the value of x. So part two, they want you to find the inverse of the matrix K. So how do you find the inverse of the matrix K? The inverse of a matrix K is given by 1 over the determinant of K times the adjoint the adjoint of the matrix k 
All right, so the determinant of the matrix K, the determinant, we were given that the determinant is a 2. So we are going to put a 2 here. Then let's find the adjoint of the matrix K. All right, so this is how you find the adjoint of the matrix K, of a 2 by 2 matrix. So you are going to swap these numbers, okay? In, in other words, uh, 2 is going to take this place where 8 is. So we are going to have negative 2, okay? So then 8 is going to take the place of negative 2. So we are going to have 8 here. All right. So then these numbers... The, the minor diagonal numbers, these, you multiply each of them by negative 1. Okay? So we're going to say negative 18 by negative 1, you have positive 18. Then negative 1 times negative... Then 1 times negative 1 is negative 1. Okay? So this is the inverse of the matrix K.